already told him. It ain't only mine when you get home. I'm cutting it off and feeding it to his dog, Batman. And it's just not giving. It's just a mess. It's a hot fucking mess. In an astounding new development, a spilled jail call from Blueface has ignited a free-for-all of speculation. The California rapper, in the midst of legal difficulties, alluded to Christian Rock as his better half. I got you. Yet what's the truth behind this stunning statement? Blueface's mom, Carlissa Saffold, didn't hold back slamming the couple for what she sees as attention-seeking jokes. Call good jail talk. Call my wife. We all heard you tell DDG that you would never marry a floozy that does all of them people in these streets. Are they genuinely engaged? Or is this simply another ploy for the spotlight? Let's examine the show and reveal the truth behind Blueface and Kisan's relationship. The spilled jail call from Blueface to Christian Rock sent shockwaves through online entertainment, with fans dissecting every word and subtlety in the recording. Blueface, otherwise called Jonathan Jamal Dorman, warmly alludes to Christian as his better half, igniting intense speculation about the nature of their relationship. However, amid the setting of legal difficulties and personal drama, parsing reality from fiction becomes increasingly difficult. Krishan's response during the call also fueled the fire as she expressed her yearning for Blueface's presence and support. Her statement of affection and loyalty only added fuel to the already bursting hellfire of gossip and speculation. Clearly, their bond, whether heartfelt or otherwise, is deeply intertwined with layers of complexity and interest. As the saga unfolds, one can't help but wonder about the motivations behind Blueface's decision to share the intimate call with the world. Was it a genuine expression of affection, or a calculated move to focus the public's attention firmly on him? The blurred lines between authenticity and performance only heighten the drama surrounding this complex pair. Blueface's imprisonment, stemming from a probation violation connected with an assault charge, adds a layer of complexity to the unfolding story. With court records specifying his confinement until July 2, 2024, the rapper's absence from the spotlight will undoubtedly fuel speculation about his relationship with Christian Rock. However, amid the tumult and confusion, one voice cuts through the noise with clarity and conviction. Carlissa Saffold Harvey, Blue Face's mom. Tattoo for us in jail. Hell, just claim the baby while you in jail. We had take ownership. Just take ownership of the baby and then we'll believe something. With a non-hogwash attitude and a sharp eye for truth, Carlissa offers a sobering perspective on her son's actions, dismissing his statements as just prison talk. She won't be swept up in that mindset of speculation and emotionalism. Her grounded presence serves as a clear contrast to the swirling storm of gossip and hearsay reminding us to approach the situation with a healthy dose of skepticism. Plan with us and then later on when he don't, when he forget wh where he came from again. In a candid interview with a reputable magazine, Carlissa Saffold Harvey doubled down on her assertions, offering a glimpse into the tumultuous dynamic between Blueface and Christian Rock. With a mixture of concern and frustration evident in her voice, she painted a picture of a relationship fraught with volatility and instability. According to Carlissa, she believes that Blueface and Christian's public displays of affection are nothing more than a facade crafted to maintain relevance amidst legal woes and personal turmoil. She asserts that Christian's toxic nature exacerbates her son's troubles, even behind bars, depriving him of the peace and stability he so desperately needs. We got one more last chance for me, and I got one more last chance for him. So that's that. The feud between Blueface's mother and Christian Rock traces back to long-standing tensions and disagreements. Carlissa has never been shy about her disapproval of Christian, often citing her as a source of trouble for her son. From alleged altercations to tumultuous drop-offs, 
Their interactions have been marked by conflict and discord. Christian's reaction to Blueface's arrest only served to exacerbate tensions between her and Carlissa. While Blueface found himself back behind bars, Krishan's response on social media raised eyebrows. Vague messages hinting at distress, coupled with emojis depicting storm clouds and broken hearts, fueled speculation about her true feelings. It's clear that their relationship, whether on or off, continues to be a source of emotional turmoil for both parties involved. You got one more last chance for me, and I got one more last chance for him. So that's that. Furthermore, Christian's recent actions, including a massive face tattoo of Blueface's mugshot, have only deepened Carlissa's disapproval. Carlissa didn't hold back in expressing her shock and dismay at the tattoo, labeling it as absolutely crazy. She questioned Christian's motive, speculating that the tattoo was yet another ploy to manipulate her son. Carlissa's candid criticism underscores the palpable rift between her and Christian, highlighting the underlying tensions that have plagued their relationship from the start. My son is not mentally capable to help her unpack all of that baggage. Um, she has a lot going on. But Carlissa's concerns aren't limited to Christian's outward displays of affection or her contentious relationship with Blueface. She harbors genuine apprehension about the impact of their relationship on her son's well-being. From accusations of toxic behavior to concerns about Christian's influence, Carlissa fears that her son is being led astray by a tumultuous and unstable partnership. Christian's behavior following Blueface's arrest further complicates the narrative. Despite their tumultuous history and previous declarations of moving on, she appears intent on giving their relationship another chance. In a candid Instagram Live session, Christian revealed her intentions to reconcile with Blueface, vowing to give him one more last chance. However, her ultimatum, coupled with threats of castration if he cheats, underscores the volatile nature of their relationship. The public's response to Krishan's actions has been mixed, with many fans expressing skepticism and concern. Some have pointed out the seemingly performative nature of her reactions, suggesting that they may be driven more by a desire for attention than genuine emotion. Speculation runs rampant as fans dissect Krishan's every move, questioning the authenticity of her sentiments and motives. In the midst of it all, Carlissa Saffold Harvey stands as a steadfast voice of reason, offering a sobering perspective on the chaos surrounding her son. Adding another layer of complexity to the narrative is the involvement of Jaden Alexis, Blueface's longtime off-again, on-again fiancé. While Blueface and Christian Rock's tumultuous relationship dominates headlines, Jaden Alexis has taken a decidedly different approach, distancing herself from the chaos engulfing her former partner. Jaden, you know about that, don't you? No, I don't. Why? Don't include me in that. You're talking to him. Don't include me. In a recent interview at a New Year's Eve party, Jaden Alexis made her priorities abundantly clear. She expressed her resolution to prioritize herself, focusing on personal growth and self-improvement. Confirming her single status, Jaden Alexis firmly stated that she is no longer romantically involved with Blueface, despite the engagement that captured public attention. She emphasized her commitment to independence and financial empowerment, asserting her intention to focus on getting this money. <laughs> Baby. No, I mean, no, I'm yeah, chilling. I'm chilling right now. You're chilling right now, okay. Getting this money, yeah, you feel me? Getting the money, okay. This disclosure unmistakably diverges from the turbulent elements describing Blueface's associations with Christian Rock and his ex. The disintegration of Jaden Alexis and Blueface's commitment comes in the midst of a background of discussion and allegations. Blueface himself conceded that his proposition to Jaden was essentially roused by a craving to fulfill her anyway. He communicated questions about Jaden's veritable love for him, proposing that their relationship coming up short areas of strength for on. Yeah, like it's like he do out of pocket shit. Like I'm not naive or something like it's not like I think he's just only going to one person for the rest of his life. Right? Moreover, Jaden Alexis activities following the finish of her commitment highlight her obligation to pushing ahead. She has remained to a great extent out of the spotlight, focusing on her own prosperity and expert attempts over contribution in the continuous show encompassing Blueface and Christian Rock. 
Yet, in the event that Jaden chose to leave the game in this circle of drama, another young lady immediately had her spot at its vertex enter. Bonnie Lash, a name that has been causing disturbances and blue countenances, too loose heartfelt, adventure with strong statements and public presentations of warmth. Bonnie has pushed herself into the spotlight, guaranteeing a huge spot in the rapper's life. In a progression of virtual entertainment posts, Bonnie exhibited her enduring dedication to Blueface, gladly showing an enormous tattoo of the rapper on her posterior. Yet her warmth doesn't stop there. She has imparted cozy minutes to Blueface, including endearing clasps, highlighting her young child Armani, communicating his yearning for daddy. Blue Bonnie's statements of affection and devotion have lighted hypothesis about the real essence of her relationship with the detained rapper. I love Blue, such a lot of he will be my man. Everlastingly, Bonnie strongly declared notwithstanding the equivocalness encompassing their association, Bonnie remaining parts unflinching in her help for the rapper, supporting for his delivery and giving him friendship from Afe. Friend but honestly, I don't want to go nowhere. <clears throat> I want my man. I anyway, the situation starts to get interesting. As Bonnie drops another stunner, she professes to be pregnant with Blueface's fourth youngster, sharing a clasp of her developing child bum. Bonnie prodded her devotees with the tempting possibility of another expansion to the Blueface family. I'm apprehensive. She composed, leaving fans hypothesizing about the fate of her implied pregnancy. I wish I could do something for him. I just feel so bad about it, though. But, like, he loves me, and I'm so excited. And then, look. As fans take apart Bonnie's intentions and the realness of her cases, hypothesis spins out of control. About the real essence of her relationship with Blueface, some recommend that Bonnie's public presentations of fondness might be driven by envy, an essential move to recover the rapper consideration from Christian Rock could Bonnie be pursuing a fight for Blueface's heart involving her pregnancy as a way to set her place in his life in the midst of the mayhem and vulnerability one. Thing stays clear. Blueface's adoration, life is everything except direct with each diversion in the adventure fans, are left enthusiastically anticipating the following part in the Raber's turbulent heartfelt excursion. The reality of the situation will surface eventually, what this most recent improvement will mean for the all-around unpredictable elements between Blueface Christian Rock and presently Bonnie Lash as the adventure of Blueface's wild love life unfurls, we're left with additional inquiries than addresses. What's the real essence of his relationship with Christian Rock? Is Bonnie Lash's pregnancy guarantee a certifiable achievement or an essential move? We need to hear your interpretation of the show. Leave your considerations in the remarks beneath. You recorded me, because I'm famous, it's annoying, but you recorded me instead of helping me. Like, that's, the, that's one thing. So you want her to leave, maybe? I would love for her to find somebody else's child to play with. I would love for her to go find another man. Blueface's mom has recently released a sensation allegation, and the web is humming in an unexpected public objection. She focuses fingers straightforwardly at Christian Rock, guaranteeing she's a danger to her grandkids' prosperity. Why well, as indicated by Blueface's Mother Rock's propensities and way of life, are a catastrophe waiting to happen, possibly hurting her valuable grandson, yet that is not all Rock isn't accepting this without a fight. She's terminating back, determined that she's the better parent. However, who's coming clean? Stay tuned as we plunge profound into this stunning quarrel. Hey man, hey man. What the f As the quarrel between Blueface's mom and Christian Rock raises, the spotlight strengthens on the wild excursion of their relationship and life as a parent with allegations flying and feelings running highs, it's fundamental to rewind the tape and comprehend the complicated snare of occasions that prompted this unstable showdown rewind to the not really far off past, and we wind up submerged in the hurricane sentiment of Christian Rock and Blueface. The world watched in interest as their romantic tale unfurled, interspersed snapshots of energy choppiness and eventually the introduction of their child, Christian Malone Jr. brought into the world on September 3rd. 
the baby immediately turned into the focal point of consideration, hailed as a sublime gift by his loving mother. Take your catheter out, okay? Can you hear me? I'm gonna take your... Anyway, in the midst of the upbeat festival of new life breaks, started to structure in the underpinning of Cretan and Blue F.A.'s relationship, their turbulent history set apart by open separations, allegations, and refusals, cast a shadow over the happy event. Blueface's non-attendance during the introduction of his child caused a stir and ignited hypothesis about the condition of their co-nurturing dynamic. Broke is a I gave birth to my kid, but I hate his father. That's what it is. Christian's sincere disclosures via online entertainment painted an image of a relationship full of doubt and strife, from charges of treachery to cases of profound and actual maltreatment. Their sentiment played out like a drama in rapturing crowds and filling newspaper titles. Uh, our adjustment to my life as a mother is to just grow with it, roll with the punches, and... Have fun with it. Um. Notwithstanding their fierce past, the couple's process veered off in a strange direction when Christian implied, at the chance of another pregnancy sending shockwaves through media outlets in a restrictive meeting with Style Nova Christian, dropped a stunner nonchalantly, referencing her longing for an enormous family. I'm gonna fill my big ass house up. I got nothing to do with him, yo. But if you have, if you do get the disclosure left fans estimating about the character of the supposed dad and the future of Christian's blossoming family. In the meantime, tales twirled about Christian's supposed sentiment with up and coming in craftsman Lil Mao. The pair's joint effort on a provocative diss track focused on Blueface powered hypothesis about the idea of their relationship. While the verses indicated a heartfelt entrapment, the two players stay hush passing on fans to estimate about the real essence of their association. In the midst of the twirling bits of hearsay, what's more, newspaper furor Blueface's dad entered. The conflict apparently affirmed affirming his child's paternity of Christian Rock's child in an endearing Instagram post. Jonathan Dorman Sr. shared his bliss at meeting his grandson, interestingly stirring up misgivings about Blueface's past cases of non-paternity who... Who do you think is the true father of Krishan Jr.? Uh, I think it's her ex... Anyway, the adventure took an emotional turn when Blueface multiplied down on his disavowal of parenthood, referring to the consequences of a DNA test as evidence of his blamelessness Notwithstanding the clashing stories, Christian stayed unfaltering in her declaration of Blueface's job as the dad of her kid, communicating worry about the effect of his refusal on their child's prosperity, I think. I think the baby looks like him. Okay. Honestly. You don't think the baby looks nothing like you at all? What you think? As the public display unfurls, one thing stays clear. The fight between Blueface's mom and Christian Rock is only a hint of something larger underneath the surface, lies a complicated embroidery of adoration double-crossing and reclamation with every disclosure, revealing insight into the complexities of present-day connections and life as a parent at the center of attention. However, in the midst of the show, legitimate difficulties add one more layer of intricacy to their generally turbulent lives, Blueface once the focal point of consideration for his outline beating hits, currently regards himself as behind bars, his presence in his kid's life seriously restricted in spite of declarations of guiltlessness. His lawful traps have gotten him far from effectively partaking in the childhood of his child in the mean. Time Christian Rock, the mother of his kid faces, her own legitimate provocus raising some questions about her capacity to give a steady climate to their posterity a single mother is one thing like you get overwhelmed and so much be like going on for in your head. Reports propose that Christian Rock is nearly joining Blueface in a correctional facility as she faces the chance of a 30-day prison sentence for disregarding the particulars of her probation anyway. The approaching danger of broadened fights in court, including various claims charging attacks could draw out her visit essentially. 
possibly leaving her youngster's future unsure with the two guardians' snared and legitimate proceedings, questions emerge about the prosperity of their kid who will take care of his childhood in their non-appearance will more distant family. Individuals step in to offer help or will the youngster become a dependent of the government? Pass on TMZ? Sure. Hell no. It's a hell no. It was a hell no then. It's oh. a hell no now. Hypothesis spins out of control as spectators. Consider the likely results of this continuous adventure. Some keep thinking about whether this development will provoke Blueface to rethink his needs and play a more dynamic job in his kid's life upon his delivery. Others guess about the effect of drawn-out divisionation from his mum on the kid's mental turn of events and profound prosperity. However, in the midst of these ponderings lies one more layer of show as Blue Countenance's mother ventures into the fry with hazardous allegations against Christian Rock in a stunning disclosure that has sent shockwaves through virtual entertainment. Blueface's mom, Carlissa Saffold, has freely blamed Christian Rock for causing her grandson's super durable incapacity. Not mentally capable to help her unpack all of that baggage. Um, she, ha she has a ton happening to her Instagram page. Saffold communicated her expectation that Rock wouldn't confront detainment for her supposed contribution in other legitimate difficulties, underscoring her conviction that Rock bears liability regarding her grandson's condition. Saffold allegations come from her conviction that Rock's way of life decisions during pregnancy, including drinking and smoking, might have added to her grandson's incapacities Fans and adherents have repeated Saffold feelings, referring to worries over Christian Rock's ways of behaving during her pregnancy and hypothesizing about the likely effect on her kid's well-being. Some have even recommended that the newborn child might be experiencing fates. Given the revealed debaucherous way of life of Rock and Blueface adding feud 